Hello and welcome to the Book Batch. I'm Victor Kilo. My guest today is author Steve Piacente. Before penning his first novel, Bella, Steve honed his writing skills in our nation's capital as a congressional beat reporter, first for the Tampa Tribune and then for the Charleston Post and Courier. He's continued his writing evolution as a speechwriter and as deputy communications director for a federal agency. I'm psyched and happy to introduce you to this fabulous first-time novelist. It's a pleasure to meet you in the book patch. Thanks for coming out. Thank you, Victor. <laughs> First of all, fantastic page-turning read. Thank you. So it took me no time at all to read this mm -hmm. book. And also, I thought it was an ingenious way to kind of raise more awareness about potentially the mm -hmm. Pat Tillman story. Are there parallels, or uh, is this something, uh, was this drawn from another real-life situation? Uh, yeah, there are parallels, but uh, and a lot of people ask me about this, but we were in production long before Pat Tillman actually, that, that situation occurred. Uh, what I learned during my research is that friendly fire deaths occur in every war. It's not an uncommon thing. All right, so I totally misguessed the motivation for writing your book, even though I did read it. So tell me this, Steve. Did you write the book as a conspiracy theory wrapped around a reporter's midlife crisis or a reporter's midlife crisis wrapped around a conspiracy theory? More the latter. More the latter. I, I was very interested in the relationship that develops between Bella, the widow, and Dan, the reporter. She enlists to help her uncover the truth about what happens to her husband. And, uh, you know, again, uh, they, they, what we learn in this story is about the power of temptation and the futility of revenge and the consequences of yielding to either, even for a second. You've actually done something quite innovative. You produced a trailer for the novel Bella. Yes. We, uh, <clears throat> we decided that we wanted to distinguish our, our website. We were a self-published book and we wanted to make a unique website. That began with the, uh, with the construction of a book trailer. And uh, we, put, uh, we put 10 plot points together from the book, which is about 300 pages, and we delivered them to uh, a very good friend of mine who's an independent film producer, and we worked on it for six months, and we got, uh, we got a pretty good product, I think. Well, let's not tease the audience anymore. Let's go straight to the trailer, and then we'll come back and talk about Bella. Sounds good. They say life passes in an instant. Not true. Three of them came to my door. It was a Wednesday morning. There was a chaplain. What is true is that we rarely stop to examine life moment by moment, unless moments occur that stop it for us. Isabel Moss was a young mother living the life she dreamed of until... This is all I got back. Is this concrete enough, Congressman? The Army stands by its position. Sergeant Moss was killed in the line of duty. Bella by Steve Piacente. One of the most poignant scenes to me is when, you know, Bella loses her husband at the height of their, the best years of their life. Right. They've just been married for a couple of years, and she has no idea what they're in store for if the marriage extends 15, 20, 25 years. And so she asks very innocently one night, of him what it's like to be married for a long time and he has to think long and hard before he answers that one. It, it's, it's often better to be young and dead than mm -hmm. have to go through mm -hmm. um, the tests and the trials and tribulations yeah. Of, yeah. of a relationship. So he has all those thoughts in his head but what he answers after reflecting that she had asked like what, what, what is Pegasus? He asks, he answers something like um, um, some things are good and some things are awful. And where can you get this? Okay, you can get Bella on Amazon.com. Mm -hmm. uh, if you just go in and put uh, Steve Piacenti or Bella, uh, you'll get our page and you'll also, I'm proud to say, see that we've received upwards of 40 very positive four and five star reviews. Um, but all the other online bookstores have it as well. I yeah. look forward to having you back on uh, the book patch. Steve Piacente, thanks for joining me today at the book patch. And thank you guys for joining me in the book patch as well. Remember, Get Bella at GetBella.com today. And that's it. That's all for now. I'm Victor Kilo. I'll see you again soon in the book patch. Mm -hmm.